we got three big things to do this morning to keep ourselves in food. Do we have uh, cupcakes? No. Why? We I'm sure mom wants to have those tonight for supper. You had your cheese stick. Let's do this. Where are your shoes, Mr. Brown? I left them up here. Did you just see him shrug? What shoes are you looking for? We need a vision. Is he a bad I, I guess we'll take anything we can get. We've got to move the chickens off the sweet potato garden. Wait, you're walking around in socks. Are these your shoes? What do you need, Lily? I need to find my bucket. Okay. There she is. Here's a bucket. Say it again. Okay, go get them. Here. Will that work? Yeah. It was right there, honey. Hear that? See that? Oh. Hear it? They knocked that down last night. These guys. We're going to save them for a little later because we want them to be good and hungry. Their home is way over there. We saw these guys out last night when we were putting away the chickens. We're lucky. We're lucky we caught them because they were, they could get in the garage. They could get in the gardens. That's where they were. Rebecca would have, I'd have been in big trouble. And the other thing we're gonna do, this is impossible. I'm, I'm starting to realize. To do all this is kind of impossible, plus the chores. But anyway, we'll try. There's some mineral feeder stuff we need to do with the cows because Stud has just absolutely torn up his mineral feeder. But I got a good idea that would make our life easier. You know, I wouldn't mind if the pigs eating the vegetables because I like pork better than veggies, but. Rebecca, she likes veggies better than pork. The chickens that have been here, I think, three, four days, they're starting to tear up the garden beds. You can see our garden beds here. We want to keep those in place. They have gotten most of the green. See? See how there's only a few of these leaves on stem anymore? It's ready. We're going to get them out and cover this up to kill off all this other vegetation and then hopefully plant a cover crop before it's too late. Let's get the first part over. Work smarter, not harder. Yeah, his, he had an idea to let the chickens out, so that will lighten it up a couple hundred pounds. Ten minutes till milking time. This is our mineral feeder. Stud just well flips it, and then all the minerals spill out like so. And he totally destroyed this wheel. It did last three years, but I'm thinking we take the legs off, we take the wheels off, and we mount this mineral feeder to the shawl. Not shawl, to the shade shelter. All right, it's nine o'clock milking time. I got this thing over here. My hope was I could put a two by four along here and here and just rest that on it and screw it to it. But that would put the two by fours right here and these mineral feeders stick down below and that would push them up so we're gonna have to go to plan b which is put a two by four across and then mount a two by four the same length this way and then 
more two by fours that go all the way across. So it's gonna be a little more complicated. It's gonna be a little more legit, I think. It is time to milk, but I think I would really like to see if I can't go ahead and get the legs and stuff off. So I got the handlebar off pretty, I mean, no, no major problems. I have a nice extension here, but it's jammed with a, another bit. How do you unjam these? Yeah, I got it. I didn't really not expect to loosen that. I expect this to go really bad. <laughs> I expect to be halted at any point now. Maybe it will be this rust. Whoa, not. I got one off easy. So rusted. Okay, let's uh, let's get this one off. I don't know how this is gonna work. It's probably gonna collapse. Here it goes. Okay, it didn't collapse. Put this back down and then finagle the. Oh my gosh. Guys, right, so you got to tighten up your neck there. All right, we've got the wheels off. Do you see what I'm doing here? That is gonna be mounted in between this. I've already made sure that it actually fits in between there. But now that I'm here, I'm like, are you sure? 91 inches. So this has got to be less than 91 inches for this to work. No, shoot! Oh man, what have I done? Yesterday I wheeled the mineral. When it was in there, I wheeled the mineral here to see if this would fit. And it would by sight, but not by measurement. Okay, if I can't get that thing in between here, and it can't be any shorter, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I just took that apart for nothing. I won't be able to use this box as one piece. I'm gonna have to, oh, I don't wanna do that. What did I say it was? I already forgot what I said it was. Well, I know it was 80 something, and that's 91. All right, we're gonna have to leave that. We are gonna have to break away and milk. It's, it's gonna be a big project because it's basically gonna have to split up. I just thought of something. We've got 18 minerals. I'm not sure we need 18 mineral spots. I think we might be able to get away with 16. I'm gonna ask Rebecca if we can get away with 16, we can shorten that up. And that'll be a lot easier than dividing and have two different systems. Hey Becky, hey, honey. how you feeling? I'm feeling good, I'm just tired. Did you sleep good last night? I actually did sleep good. I good. Sleep good. How many minerals do we need? For the cows. How many mineral feeders? Well, if they're going to have... It's 15 and then selenium is 16 and kelp is 17. And... Alright. Where you been all morning? <laughs> huh? <laughs> Back here with your t-shirt on and your shorts. I see where you been. Milking time. Yeah. You guys getting hungry? That's good. Let's get them good and hungry. After milking, we'll take them out. All right, done milking. Let's go see what's wrong with those pigs. Okay, I'm looking at this on the way to the pigs. Am I sure that's wrong? That that won't fit? Look how close that is. Oh, it's just inch, it's four inches. Jonah had an idea to add an extension to where you just lay it across. He's thinking it's still gonna be on the ground. So that made me it's think though, I think it needs to be up. Wow. Why? Because I'm afraid they would step on it and stuff. Thinking though, with your idea though, <laughs> because oh. it's so close, I still think they could, oh, this will get in the way, you can't really. What if we put it built a shelf that came out and then it was braced right here? I don't know if that's gonna be And cool. it was far enough away so this is still off the pole and they can still lift it. I think that would work. That'd be better than having to split this in half have two different feeders. I think we'd have to order more. Maybe we'd have enough mat. And then, guys, if it's out here, that gives them more room. That still gives them the same amount of room and we're not taking any of their shade. We've got our plan for that. I think we're back to, Matt can do this pretty quick. Let's get these pigs. Let's figure out what we're going with the pigs. Whoa. They tore it up. Okay, it's on. It's connected, this is bad. This is bad if they broke out of this 
on fence. They've been bad to break out of fences. This fence has been holding them for a very long time. And I hope it, yeah, hope they were fighting and knocked it over and were able to get out. Can raise them in a stall for the rest of their life, but I don't want to do that. All right, they've worn this area out. Let's move, let's set it all up. And then we'll go get, let's set them up in a new area and then go get them. I figured out our problem. And I'm glad we found a problem because I don't want them just busting through a hot fence. One of our batteries was dead in this. This was on, but when you tested it, hitting at zero. Let's try it. I've switched out the battery. Okay, that seems better. Okay. Yes, 13.0. We're back in business. You guys ready? Yep. I'm gonna be taking the feed. Josiah's got the drone. Jonah's got the pig board. Do you think they're good and hungry? Pig, 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 give him a little sample. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, they're big. They're big. They're big. Oh, shoot. Hold this camera, Jonah. Ready? Oh, gosh. Okay. All right. Pig, 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 pig. Pig, 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 pig. Pig, 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 pig. Pig, 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 pig. We got a long, long way to go. This is quite peaceful. Yeah, it is. No problem. Pig, 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 pig. Hey, Rebecca's going to have two eggs on her sandwich. That's an improvement. Here you go, darling. Oh, thank you. Double egg sandwich. Oh, yeah. All right, well, I lost a couple of my <laughs> farm hands right there, didn't I, Becky? Yep. Legos for the win. Lily, you want to go do the mineral show with me? What? All right. We got our supplies over here. Got my faithful helper. All right, our temporary legs worked. I'm able to get it over there. You know, I'm gonna put a board on here and brace it. I just realized if I brace it like this, which is maybe what I was thinking, it may not be as strong as if I brace it like this. All right, stud muffin. Eat your heart out, buddy, because I'd like to see you flip that. Looks kind of cool too. And you move the shed, you you move the minerals, the shade, and soon to be milking stanchion all at once. Well, Lily went and worked with me, so I agreed to go watch. It. Her swim. So guys, I have this really cool trick. I can actually ride on a drone. See guys, I can ride on a drone. <laughs>